This morning uh, temporarily we are at the big tent it is the quartzite sports vacation and RV show coming up here starting on Saturday today's Wednesday we're working with Barry with fire and ice outdoor gear we're here to get our badges for the vendor area and to figure out how we start setting up we're going to work see what they'll let us do today yeah, uh, all of our things, I think, arrived yesterday. Barry sent tracking numbers, so I've got all the tracking numbers. It looks like all the products are here, tables are here. Everything we've ordered should be here. I just hope they're maybe at our spot. So we'll see how that goes. We're heading over to the vendor check-in trailer. This is the tent. It's 700 feet long by 100 feet wide. Massive building, or massive tent. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Well, I don't know about the... Yeah. Okay. Cool. We got all our stuff. We got our name badges. We got our vehicle uh, little permit thing so we can come in and out as we need to. We got everything taken care of. That was pretty painless. It was pretty painless. Yeah. yeah. She was yeah. nice. She was super nice. She said, I only buy it once. And I don't <laughs> think she bit even that much. So, uh, yeah. I said, all oh, the days, the days young, the days young. All right. We're going to go uh, walk in. She said, all our stuff should be at our site, so we'll go see what we... She said if it's not there, just hold tight, it'll, it'll, it'll be get there. there. So, we'll go have a look. Let's see what we got going on down here. Oh no, this is our... Our stuff isn't here yet. That's not, that's not Barry's stuff. This is Fire and Ice. We've got cellular sales next to us. Cellular sales, two booths. Two booths, and then... Across from us is Beauty and... Beauty and Good Creations. Okay, so the women are going to be shopping there. Oh, we perfect. can have to send their men over so here. Nutrition. A nutrition booth. And nutrition. RV poop shoot. <laughs> RV poop shoot. Uh, RF Enterprises, not sure what they are. And Red Beards. Red Beards. I don't know what Red Beards is. Uh, Could be beard products? I don't know. This one, not no, nothing sure. here. California solutions. But uh, anyway, okay. our stuff isn't here yet. So I guess we will go. Um, we'll go back in the van. We'll make breakfast. We haven't had breakfast yet. Pop out the back. And uh, maybe make some coffee and settle in here for a little while. Roadmaster, they got one, two, three, four. Wow. Escapees. Escapees is here. All right. We'll. Uh, We'll pop in and out then throughout the day and see when our stuff might arrive. Heather just came by, let us know she delivered our tables and things to our booth. So we're on our way to start the setup. See how it goes. All right, as promised, Heather. Awesome, thank you. Some stuff. Thank you, Heather. Tables and things, we can start doing something. Oh boy. Awesome, here we go. Barry, here's your booth. All your stuff arrived. Bailey's here, employee of the month. Oh, 
Well, we got most of the stuff figured out today. We've got things, those are all axes under the uh, sheet there. We've got our knives all set up here, kitchen sets. These are the Cooks's fishing gear in the corner there. Uh, and then the stuff in the middle is all miscellaneous things we got to go through tomorrow. So we've got a lot of progress made here today. Whew. We're ahead of the game. Yeah, we're ahead of the game. It's uh, 5.15. Bailey was telling us she's hungry. We're ahead of all these people. <laughs> day one of setup in the books. That was a full eight hour day. Yeah, we waited. Had to wait around for our deliveries. And... Yeah, we got here a little after nine, checked in. Deliveries happened. Uh, 11? A little after 11? Yeah, we didn't get started until about 12, I think. Mm -hmm. So, but we're done doing that for today. We're going to head back to our campsite and we'll come back and do it again tomorrow. Yeah. Got a good handle on it, I think. Yeah, we've got everything sorted. Mm -hmm. like, like Sherry said in there, we're ahead of everybody else that's in there, yeah. just about. Well, we got a lot accomplished today at the show. We've got our uh, knives and kitchen sets pretty much set up. Uh, at least an idea of where they're all going to be. We started with our axes and hatchets all along back there. This next section is going to be the bow area. Don't know what that's going to look like yet, but that's where that's going to live. Where Sherry is standing in front of, this is our camping gear stuff, small things. Then we've got our Kuxa cups are going to live in this area here predominantly. They will be mixed and mingled throughout the whole uh, display. And we've got a good handle on the fishing. So we've got a, a lot of our reels out in boxes. We've got our rods displayed up there. Not sure what the rest of this table or that's going to look like yet. But uh, we've got a good handle on it. Got a good start. So we're going to put the sheets over everything, cover everything up, and head out. It was another long day, but got a, got a good handle on it. This is what we looked like all covered up for the day. All right, let's go get dinner. Well, we've done all we can do for today. Uh, at our booth, so we're just walking around checking out other vendors and their displays and what else is all here. Wow, this is crazy. It's amazing how many booths still are not set up and don't even have their materials delivered on site yet. Probably not their, probably not their first rodeo. No. <laughs> All right, we're going to continue walking around uh, and then we're going to go look for maybe some things to pretty up our booth, something to display the axes better. Uh, and then I think we're going to go on a slingshot assembly duty. Spend the rest of the afternoon doing that so we have some pre built slingshots for sale. This is at the far end of the tent uh, from the opposite side of where we are. So we go, we go back in here. So we are middle row, far row over, almost all the way down on the other side. Coming down the center aisle here. Well, the rest of our team showed up, Barry, Randy, and Blake. They're inside right now, finalizing some things at the booth. We are on gopher duty, looking for clamps and different things that they're gonna need. And uh, it's 8.30, the show opens in a half an hour. And look at the lineup already for people waiting to get in. That's crazy. <laughs> at least they're in the sunshine and it's warm. It was, it was dang cold in that tent this morning. All right, we're gonna go find some things. We're playing extreme desert darts. Oh! <laughs> My fault. 
Fart. So, so Judy has been doing great until she's choked the last several times. Oh, oh. The score is nine to nine. Sherry came. Sherry came back from it was. It was nine to five, and and she's coming back. Ooh. That's all you had to do. Yeah, I I I think I think now. Yeah. Just the gravy. Yeah, Sherry won it. There you go. That's nice form right there. Thank you. All right, all right. So, so it's, it's Jennifer and Sherry <laughs> now. Because we. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, you got, you got, where's your form? Where's your form? Think about it here. Oh, oh nice. That's okay. Oh, all right. You still, you still got the point. I think Sherry got the point. Okay. Rhythm right here. Quite on the green. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Sherry's that. first throw went right in. Look at that. I didn't get it on video. I should have been videoing. Yeah, okay, Woo! Go. Three go. points. So Sherry is the big winner. This is her victory throw. She's got both of hers in the circle. Mine failed to, to knock hers Thank out. You. Thank you. Thank you. It's a little bit busier in here than it was the other day, but not nearly as busy as it was on opening day on Saturday. It was wall to wall, shoulder to shoulder people. Just kind of doing a quick walk around here, taking a little break from the booth. There's a, there's a ton of people in here today. It's a windy day and cold outside, so I think, I think as the day goes on, more people are gonna be wanting to be inside here than the outside vendors. We're coming to you from the front of Notable Exceptions, Notable Road Machine, their big 30 something foot RV. The big windshield. The big windshield in the back there. And yeah, it's a beautiful view out the, out the windshield. So the big tent show is over and done and in the books. Um, we didn't have a lot of time really to do much filming while we were there. No, we hit the ground running pretty much. Every every day we were there, it was it was pretty much nonstop, just go go go. And even when we did have a little pause in the action, I, I didn't think about filming. Yeah, doing much video out of the booth. So uh, let's see. I I will say that the show was a great success for Fire and Ice. They uh, it, it, it was. It was a wonderful show for them, and I think they're very uh, happy that they made the decision to come out here this year. The show has run very professionally. They've just got it dialed in. It's just amazing. Well, this is their 40th event. For, yeah, their 40th year doing it. Uh, and everybody is so nice and Everybody helpful. we spoke with and worked with who is associated with the show, with putting the show on, wonderful, wonderful people to work with. So I, I really hope Fire and Ice decides to come back next year. We're gonna spend a little more time here in Arizona uh, until we need to head east. So we're gonna be hanging out with Jennifer and Judy for a while. They've got a couple concerts coming up which we might be able to attend, at least one of them. One is a private event, we won't be able to do that, but they've got another one that's a, uh, I think is gonna be a public show. So we're hoping to do that. Uh, and that's about it. I mean, we're it was gonna go find a new place to call home for a little bit. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna, you know, we patch we... a desert somewhere. Yeah, we're uh, we're gonna be going back to visit Terry and Ann and Carly and just kind of be bopping around here with free spirits for a month or so. But um, yeah, the 2023 Quartzsite Sports Vacation NRV show in the books. Check. <laughs>